Hello, this is Francisco Cribari, and today I want to show you how to deal with uh, underexposed images using Darktable. You, we are going to use this base curve module, which is applied to raw images, and there will be an option there that will be quite useful. Let me open an image here. So as you can see, this is a raw image. It was shot with a Fujifilm camera and X-Pro2 camera. And it's clearly underexposed. Darktable applies the <coughs> Fujifilm-like base curve here. And what we can, we're gonna do is to use this option here, Fusion. The default is none. We are going to change that to two exposures. You see, we got some improvement here. And we are going to now change that to three exposures. You see, much, much better. <coughs> you have <coughs> two sliders here, exposure shift and exposure bias that you can play with. I, re I recommend that you read the documentation. Basically, what it does is this here. It merges the image with one or two copies of itself after applying the current base curve and boosting its exposure by a selectable number of EV units. <coughs> and this is the exposure shift slider and the exposure bias slider. You can read about that and you can play with those sliders but as you can see we got um, a clear improvement by just using the fusion option in the base curve so this was a quick video just to show you how to deal with the underexposed images in dark table i hope you found it useful if you found it useful Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.